Good morning, this is Robin Bremer from Walks with God, and uh, today I'm driving because I'm pretty busy, so I'm going to talk to you about the things God talked to me while I'm driving. Um, the thing that God impressed upon me today that I was really excited about, and that is, uh, we put three scriptures together that's really life. And the first one I want to go over is um, Exodus 33:18. and whoops, there's a lump there, I need better shocks. Uh, Moses uh, said, uh, um, I want to show your, uh, I want to see your glory. But before he said, I want to see your glory to God, I don't want to go anywhere unless you go with us, unless your presence goes with us. And then he said, show me the glory. And God says, I will cause my goodness to pass in front of you and proclaim my name. So the goodness of God is his glory. Everything about God is good. <laughs> Okay, then the other one was 145, 10 through um, 12. And it says, um, all the saints will praise you and they'll bless you. And they'll tell of the glory of your kingdom and speak of your power. That, so that all men would know of your mighty acts and your glorious splendor of your kingdom. Well, the first thing that I want to point out here is... Um, that we're supposed to tell about the glory of the kingdom and we're supposed to actually that word means boast boast about the glory of the kingdom and speak of your power a lot of people say oh you know you're supposed to seek God and, and uh, talk about God don't talk about anything else well God says that we're supposed to talk about signs wonders and miracles speak about the power and the things that he's done and I thought that it was neat that it said and the glorious splendor of your kingdom that's pretty powerful and then there's one more scripture I want to go over. That's uh, Psalms uh, 63. It says, Oh God, you are my God. Earnestly and early will I seek you. My soul thirsts for you. My body longs for you in a dry and thirsty land where there is no water. Just, uh, I have seen you in your sanctuary and beheld your power and your glory. And some other uh, interpretations say uh, that to see your power and your glory. And... Um, and it's okay. These scriptures show me that even in the Old Covenant, people, people were seeking God's power and glory. And if they could ask to see God's uh, glory, and God showed them His glory, which is His His, uh, uh, His goodness and His name, then we, we carry the glory in us. We can ask God to show His glory. And we can ask Him to go with us. And another thing I want to point out about those scriptures is... We, it talks about how we physically feel God's glory and presence on our physical body, not just our spirit and our soul longing for it, but uh, our physical flesh. And it's okay to seek the glory. It's okay to ask God to show and reveal the glory because the glory is His goodness and the glory shows all men that aren't saved, shows His goodness and His kingdom. So that's my revelation for today. Uh, it's been a bumpy ride in the truck. I hope I hope that you got a hold of it and are as excited about it as, as I am. And God bless you. This is Robin Bremer with Walks with God. Have a great day.